Hello, it's Get Carter here with another episode of Oxygen Not Included, and in today's episode, um, I'm not going to do what I said I was going to do, which probably isn't surprising. Uh, what I've done is, I'm just going to put all this on 8 because I want this done. Uh, I'm not really fussed about the rest of it, although that, yeah, no, that can wait. Um, I was trying to think of a way to cool down the hydrogen, but I've got all of this salt here. So, what I'm going to do is uh, put salt water here, have the hydrogen heated up and separate the water from the salt, then ship the salt off and have um, air tiles for the steam to go up and then cool down. At least that is my thought theory now I can I use steel tiles because I didn't have the iron but I've actually got some more iron so now, let's use that instead of steel shall we so what I'm gonna do is have the hydrogen in here I'm gonna have a pump off to the side with the thermo and atmo sensors here to make sure it's cool enough and there's high enough pressure. Then I'm going to open the door and have uh, the pump here pump the hydrogen out. Now I think they're made of steel. I think they'll be fine in the higher temperatures. But we will find out. A lot of the temperatures should... What are you? 100 sets? 125 or whatever. A lot of the temperatures should sort of... Could you get that done? Not sure where they should just be able to get the iron from here. Actually, don't know where they have to get it from and how long and how it's taken so long. Uh, what have we got? All right, so now that's hooked up. We can hook up this one. You're still. Hmm. How was I actually going to do this? Oh, that was a new day. That did not like that. We'll actually put this one down here, I think. And I think you were going to not be done. And you can go. Yeah, so we've had to rewire a bit. All of that can go, and yeah, what are we gonna, how are we going to do it? That can go. There we go. We'll do that. Now we've got some diamond temp shift plates to try to get the temperature from the hydrogen into the metal, which will go into the water. Um, I've got, um, yeah, you're going to go. I've got an Atmos sensor up here, just in case the air or the steam pressure gets too high, and I've got a pipe running through, which I'm going to use to cool it if I need to. Why did you, it's just sand. No, did it get too hot and it formed into, not sure. What I need is for... So this is slowly getting done. In the meantime, we have got uh, these ones over here. So we've got our power... How far is our power done so far? So the power's going to come all the way down here, down here. Uh, that can go there now that that's done. I'm not going to open up this until I need to. And we got that power in there, that power in there. Uh, and what we'll do, I think, is... I don't know. We'll make this obsidian. So put that one in there, and then we'll put the power in. We might need to... Uh, no, that looks reachable, so we'll leave that for the moment. And see what happens. How's this one going? This is getting a little bit more covered. Uh, we do have more? Yeah, a couple hundred. Alright, so what's steel? Your steel, your steel. Alright, let's 
so we'll make these two iron as well. Give this back a little bit more steel. So basically this door... Yeah. So right, we don't need this open. But what we want is... Like if it was below 105, then we'll open it up and pump it out. Although, I mean, technically we could probably get it to 70 or 80 because of the water that's being pumped in, but I don't know. Maybe we'll say below 100. We'll see how we go. That can be adjusted later on anyway. Now, what I'd really like is for this to be enclosed. Look at that heat. Yeah, it's super heating this area. They're in suits, so hopefully that will be fine. You're doing iron out there. What's that up to? 126. Yeah, so we just got to wait until they can do these. I really want to set this up before I do anything. Now, what power? 850. That's what it got. No, that hasn't got it. We can't put power on here because it'll put it over a thousand. Now, what I technically can do is just put a put a uh, there. Put that there, and what we'll do is we'll put this like that and put that away. Yeah, that's a convenient way to do it. It's probably not the permanent solution, but um, as a temporary one, works fine. And we'll get all of that there. Yeah, so we just need to do all the things. I think so. With this one, what we want to do is really like that done. Can we just get these ones done, please? And have a look at how... Oof. Yeah, that's a fair bit of heat, but that's fine. We'll deal with it. We'll get that done. Um, we'll empty it out, and I think we'll... Actually, we're going to get these ones done as well. Get that done. I'm not too worried about putting it on nine, because there's only four of them... Yeah, look at that idle. Probably because... What have I done? Are you going? Oh, you don't have oxygen. Uh, now, are we still producing... We've got enough oxygen in the base, but... Not enough in these suits. There's not any in these suits. Why is there no oxygen in the suits? All right, what's going on here? What did I break? I broke that. Uh, that doesn't help. Let's uh, fix that up. So is that breaking the system because... Pipe blocked. So what output pipe of yours is blocked? This output pipe. So why aren't you... Oh, it's got no power. Ah. Now when I said that it wasn't important, that power... Yeah, well, it sort of is. Um, how can we fix this in a very fast way? Because I broke one thing and it just broke the whole system. Only requires 10. Hmm. How about we cancel all that deconstruct?
And maybe we... Alright, so are you still intact? Uh, yes, you are. Unintended consequences. Alright. So if we can get this one... Missing tile, blah blah. Uh, no, you are not deconstructed. Ah. Right. So if we get that one done really quickly, like really quickly, ah, has that got power? That's got power. Ah, and that should. There we go. There we go. Alright, so I mucked up in a couple of spots there. Alright, so we should start getting uh, deliveries of oxygen back. Hopefully. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully the others... Yeah, they're getting close. We need to do this diamond. Have you got diamond? Yeah, you do. Alright, that worked. When they didn't have to go through two suits, um, it was a lot easier for them. Um, you technically are hooked in on that power. If we could get this bit done, um, I could drop that one. Come on, you were doing it. There we go. Thank you for that. Alright, so that's done, that's done. Uh, we're going to do that one. Alright, come on, do it, do it. Um, do I really want obsidian? No. Like that. Did it really matter? Probably not. Alright, we're going to get that done in a hurry. And the next one, please. And it should over-pressure it. Yeah, it'll over-pressure itself and stop. There we go. Sweep that one up. We'll put the um, necessary stuff here. We'll do that on seven. Um, all right, so theoretically, we're going to put the salt water in here. The heat's going to make it steam. The steam will go up here and we'll use this pipe to cool it if required. I don't know. I don't know how it's going to go. And then we'll pump the water out. Hold on. Yeah, it's fine. Um, and we'll just you add, do you add a gold. Pump the water out. We'll put um, seal the system in here. We don't Ah, so you're good. So what I want to do is deconstruct, actually. Um, power. No, no, I want to deconstruct. Deconstruct all of that. And what we'll do is... Uh, no. I oh, wanted to go down there. Uh, we can't go down yet. So we'll deconstruct and not until this gets this gets done up. Uh, so we won't deconstruct anything else there. But we'll deconstruct those ones and we'll do that on a seven just to get rid of it. Yeah, so you're at seventy eight. Is this one back down no? Seventy six point three. Now, we're going to put the plumbing. So this water is basically going to go... Uh, where are we? Into this system to get cooled. Uh, so this one's going to have to go... Uh, this is going to get messy. 
think up there, up there, and into here. I'm not sure how this loop's going to work yet, so... And into there, I think. Because we want... The water that comes out of here is going to be like 100 or whatever, so we want it cooled down. And the other thing I want to do is make sure there is enough of it. Uh, what automation am I looking for? Hydro sensor, please. Um, what do you... Mm, yeah, it's not going to work. Um, do you... Nah. So that'll shut off if it gets too high. None of you get stuck, please. I just... Can you reach that? Can someone reach that? Do it, before you do anything else. Come on, someone pick that up. Can you pick that up? Yes. Alright. Back to gold. Uh, you've got no power, but we did... Yeah, we did that. And you want to go up here. <coughs> uh, no one's idle. New printables are available. Um, I mean, you're not terrible, Mima. I don't really have a place to put you at the moment. Although, if we deconstructed that, uh, put a door here to stop them. I mean, we could. How about we... I mean, we are producing enough... Yeah. Oh, is that third one doing it now? 77. It is cooling down. Um. What did I disable auto repair on? Oh, interstate liquid pipe. Um, that's unfortunate. Oh, what are you at? 74. 74.9. What's the temperature at? 74.7. Yeah, that oxygen's at 73. Uh, it should be fine. It should start to um, peter out now. So that's 167, that's 163. Yeah, and as soon as we seal this system in, then that won't have any more heat on it. Um, new person. Uh, our food is, yeah, our food's going up lots. Uh, so what we want to do is get that bed done. Uh, we've got another spot. And we'll see. So, welcome Mima, and you've got another one. I want to get exosuit training for her as quickly as possible. Um, I might take advanced research, just so she gets skill points faster, and then I'll do the exosuit training. So, Mima is not allowed in exosuits either. Because she will go so slow as to be utterly um hmm that's a problem all right fine she can go underneath there's nothing really happening down below anyway so um you cannot go anyway and this one will do you can't go out. Um, oh god, these are on overheat damage as well. 76. Alright, so what do we got here? Now, do we need to make this a vacuum? Yes, we do want it to be a vacuum. A normal 
gold is... Eh, we'll try gold. If I need to, I can open it up again. Um, it's not really what I wanted, but... Uh, it is life. Now, is that going to be too much? So I've got 240, 240, 240, 240. You're not powered. Ah. So we'll give it power and we'll give it the automation wire to turn itself off. If I don't want it. Um, we can turn that on and off with the water and control it. And we don't need to... Hmm. Actually, we don't need to do that anymore because what we can do is we'll automate automate that directly. And deconstruct you. Ah, so that is going to stop... Um, I don't know, you can deconstruct. Just on a five, you're not very important. So that should stop the heat um, in this area. And as soon as we manage to do uh, all of this, and we'll sweep up this, and we'll do this one. Yeah, it's on eight. They're doing it as fast as they can. All right, so that's now covered. I'm going to be very sad because I didn't know that I deleted that because I wasn't paying attention. Uh, on a nine, please get that back in. Yeah, where are we going? Uh, no errors. Whoops. Uh, we'll check on. Yeah, once the processes check on our water. All right, that's really dropping down. Um, that's relatively stationary. I think what we need to do is uh, we need to find a way to. Pump this into here. Might have been good if I thought about having to put two pipes through here. Nope, not you. Right, so you go like this. Uh, we got plumbing. Right, so you go there. You go. Oh, where's the water? Alright, it's all the way down here. So I think what we want to do is plumbing. Um, go there. I just want to make sure they're there first. Alright, so run all the water. So it goes down there, down there, down here, and across that one, and into there. Just because I think we're going to run out. Yeah, we're going to run out soon enough. Now, did that accidentally all go on? Yeah, it did. This needs to be a six. Yeah. So you're pumping there. Ah. Now... Why are you not filling up with battery? Um, tonight. So do these not have... Uh, yeah, this will fill up first. But then we'll start going here and these will start... What I didn't do is... Yeah, I should have thought of that, shouldn't I? Uh, that's right, they'll survive in uh, polluted water. Let's get this. And then maybe we'll get... Uh, we'll get that done. And then we'll go here. Yeah, so there's the... Um, 
There's a polluted water that we uh, can go as well. We'll have to take care of. Alright, so these things, what are they? 34. I just ran. Didn't I run? I just automatically connected it without thinking. You go. Get rid of that. Um, please go on auto. Okay. We've got it all set up, the entire system. What I will do quickly is. Oh, not so quickly. We're going to pump out this place to make it a vacuum. As quickly as we can, we're going to say. I'm not going to say anything. We'll set this once this is a vacuum. So, what do we got? We've got a fair amount to pull out, unfortunately. It's not that big an area. So, I don't think it'll take very long. Alright, you are in a vacuum. So, that off. As long as it's below. I don't know. Say 19. Thousand below 19,000 grams. All right, so this actually won't be cooling down very much at all. But what we want to do is to say, as long as you're above um, above 800 grams and you're below, um, there we go. That should open and that should pump in. And that will get rid of that one. So this should be able to... Um, 10 kilos. Yeah. So we'll see when this stops being overpressured. And that is dropping below 9. When do you next... So that can keep going. It should actually keep going because this can pump out more than that. And you're not really... Ah, that should just suck in the heat. You're in a vacuum. Your not, temperature's not going up. Um, now, I'm, yeah, no. Tell you what, when the pressure is 3,000, because at least that way you'll do decent packets. I'll see, when this stops and becomes dormant again, I might change this to um, add in a pressure sensor in here to make sure it actually doesn't run unless it's 500. Alright, you're going up. 82. Oh, new day dawns. If I tile. Yeah, I don't think this is. Oh, it is slowly going up. I mean, it will go up, but I think this is going to take a long time before it actually gets any heat in it. And seeing that it's got a dormant cycle, I'm not even sure if the heat will remain. Yeah, so how are you looking? Yeah, when this becomes dormant again, I'm going to open this up and stick a pressure gauge in there so it'll stop when it's below 500. And maybe we'll drop this at 2,000. Put it at 2,000. And I might also put a delay in it. Uh, so this door doesn't close, or doesn't close straight away, and that should stop the continual opening and closing. Yeah, you lot are doing there. All right, so we've got enough power, no power. Yeah, we got a little power coming. We've got enough power, I think, with the um, petroleum generators. Uh, we'll end this with uh, printables. 
What do we got? Rust. We don't have a lot of rust. We're just going to go rust. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.